Good afternoon, cyclists. This is Rick. Today is Sunday, March the 5th, 2023. Started the bike ride at 27 minutes after 1. I'm riding my Linsky Helix bike today. have a new rear tire after my flat on Thursday so this is new tire week on both bikes today's weather 78 degrees clear wind is out of the east at 12 miles an hour with 22 mile an hour gusts so I guess it's gonna be a little breezy today Today's route, I'm gonna ride through Kingwood uh, Villages, down to uh, San Jacinto Bayou Greenway, take that west to uh, Hamlin Road, Hamlin Road to Loop 494, and then up over US 59 on Sorters McClellan Road to Sorters Road, and then north past uh, the West Fork High School and then into Kingwood Place. Then on through uh, Kingwood Place, Oakhurst, Valley Ranch, back to US 59, and then uh, south to North Park, and then back into uh, Kingwood through Woodridge Forest. Early in the ride, going on some uh, Greenbelt Trail, Hunter's Ridge. Now I'm back, headed back to the streets. Riding west alongside Kingwood Drive. Most of my rides, I'm going the opposite direction. I'm going east. Today I'm going west. Four point three miles and time is forty eight minutes after one. On the Greenbelt Trail, riding south, leaving the South Woodland Hills. Underneath Kingwood Drive and then into uh, Trailwood Village. Seven point nine miles. Time is three minutes after two. Still on my way to uh, San Jacinto Bayou Greenway. Continuing on the uh, Greenbelt Trails in uh, Trailwood Village, Kingwood. Going across my little bridge there. Ride right on when I go this direction. my way towards Woodland Hills Drive which will take me to San Jacinto Bayou Greenway entrance 8.7 miles seven minutes after two average speed 13.0 miles an hour overall riding over Woodland Hills Drive South. I'm going to turn and merge over to the right onto the Greenbelt Trail. Take me to the entrance to the San Jacinto Bayou Greenway. The car is parked over there because they don't have the big K stickers to park. All right, this is the entrance into the San Jacinto Bayou Greenway. This section takes me from Woodland Hills Drive to Hamlin Road. I think while I was on the Greenbelt Trail, I was sniffing pollen 
sneezed a few times. So my nose is running now. Turning left off of North Shore Drive onto another segment of the San Jacinto Bayou Greenway. This one takes me to Sun Sunrise, no, Sunset Trail. Here we go to Sunset Trail. Sunrise Trail. <laughs> I'll get it right someday. Riding west on Hamlin Road. Up over the railroad tracks and then a little bit past that is Loop 494 where I'll turn right. Just turn left from uh, Loop 494, going up over US 59, and on to Sorters Road. Riding north on Sorters Road, getting ready to pass West Fork High School. I'll turn right once I get past the school. I think it's on Kingwood Place Drive. Riding north on Briarberry Lane. I rode through Oakhurst. Now I'm going to be going through Briar Tree on my way to FM 1314. About a mile away from FM 1314. Nineteen point one miles, and it's fifty three minutes after two. At the stop sign, I'm turning left off of Sunrise Trail onto the next segment section of San Jacinto Bayou Greenway. Doesn't go very far until it crosses Forest Cove Drive. continues on. The section of the greenway interrupted by Marina Drive, which will take me to the next section past the Forest Cove Community Center and Pool. Eleven point six miles. Time is twenty minutes after two. This is the end of the San Jacinto Bayou Greenway. Even though the sign points an arrow, it doesn't go anywhere because we're waiting on Harris County, I believe it's Precinct 3, to build a section that goes through Edgewater Park. Now we're gonna ride on some gravel and dirt up to the uh, fence ahead, and then that's Hamlin Road, where I'll turn left. 12.2 miles, 23 minutes after 2. 
Overall average speed, 13.2 miles an hour. Here's some gravel. All right. Turned right off of Briarberry Lane. I'm on a short section of Old Sorters Road. It'll take me to FM 1314. Cross over FM 1314. That'll become Valley Ranch Parkway. Lake alongside Valley Ranch Parkway. Street intersection coming up ahead is Azalea Boulevard. See the wind with the flags. As I turned right off of Valley Ranch Parkway on the Valley Ranch Bend Drive, I have a flat rear tire. This is going to be habit forming. I'm at uh, 21.8 miles and it's seven minutes after three. I'll go over here and see if I can fix this tire. I did a quick inspection of the tire and I don't see anything that's causing it so i have to do deeper inspection all right i think i got the flat fixed i also think i was the cause thursday when i was replacing the uh, rear tire and putting the tube in i think i didn't get the tube inside the tire in one spot and pinched it so there was just a tiny hole i inspected the inside of the tire couldn't find anything and uh, so and a, Put the patch on and the tire seems to be staying firm so the time is 343 we're back getting ready to head out on the bike ride back on valley ranch bend drive i made the u-turn at north park drive riding north on the frontage road Gonna turn right on Knox, East Knox Street up ahead. Just past the trucks. 27.0 miles times five minutes after four. Average speed's 14.0 miles an hour. The rear tire seems to be holding up. Riding east through Woodridge Forest. On my way back to Kingwood. 29.2 miles. It's 415. My average speed is still 14.0 miles an hour. Rear tire still feels firm. That's good. I'm getting close to, close to the end of the ride. Riding into the wind though, 